Oh, I'm really excited, you know, got to make big things happen, you know, make up an upset, you know, make it to nationals and whatnot. But like you said, you know, I've been to a couple conference tournaments already and nothing quite as big as the Big 12s, but it is good experience and, you know, something to build on, you know, and it'll prepare you for nationals even better than, you know, our old conference. So I'm excited, really excited. I'm very excited, you know, I worked very hard for this opportunity, uh, not just this year, but um, starting my wrestling career, this is what we worked hard for. and. Uh, you know, it's excited to finally fulfill some, a goal, a career goal. So Yeah, we're looking forward to it. You know, we've been training um, hard and, and uh, having some good training cycles here. And, you know, this is, this is the emphasis that we have on the entire season, you know. So um, you go fight for another two weeks of your season right now. So there's a lot of incentive, a lot of um, emotion involved, and, and uh, this is the time to be your best. We've done some different things, you know. We've, we've had some kind of um, unusual workouts. We've, we've hit some stadiums. We've gone up in the mountains and, and ran in the snow a little bit, done a little Rocky Four. Um, we've gotten in the pool and uh, done a little bit of that too. So there's some different things that we've done to put our body through some things that they haven't felt. Um, and, and then we've been focusing on matches. We've been focusing on, on our, um, you know, just squeezing out a little bit more conditioning. and, and uh, Probably, you know, the other area is, is trying to chain wrestle and, and string our matches um, to a complete level. You've wrestled everyone, so you know what they have to come, you know, to the table and what you have to bring to the table as well. Um, you just got to be ready for what they have to offer and um, learn from and learning from what the downfalls and sustaining what you did well on with those people as well. It hurts and helps you when you wrestle that many people that much, you know, and but it's part of the sport too. They say the hardest thing is continuously beat somebody. So, you know, I, I got a got a lot to do, you know, and you gotta push forward and just, you know, keep my head up and honestly just believe that you can beat anybody and it's the truth, <laughs> you know. So you know, everybody's in a little bit different situation. We got three guys that earn spots for their for their weight class. Um, they're in a pretty good position. Everybody else needs to be fighting. Um, you know, whether it's your first time there or not, it doesn't matter. I mean, that, that, that's irrelevant to um, the NCAA committee when they choose the at-large bids. They don't care if you've been to the NCAA tournament before. They don't care what your record was. Um, that all they care about is what you're doing right now, um, how you perform at the tournament, how your season's gone. So throw those things out the door. It, it doesn't matter. You, you come to wrestle and, and uh, if, you're, if it's your first time, if you're a true freshman, you're Greg Foster, story's the same, you know, and, and uh, do, do what you can uh, control um, and go in there and, and wrestle your best. You know, momentum is everything. Um, momentum uh, builds confidence, and um, right now I feel very confident due to that momentum that I've been having. We'll continue to use it as long as it can last, so hopefully I'll take you somewhere far. Uh, there's going to be you know, some battles. There's going to be some dog fights. Everybody coming back through the constellation has has a lot of incentive um, to wrestle their best. So you're not going to see guys lay down. You're going to see guys coming back through the backside fighting harder than they probably have their entire life, um, which is going to make for some great wrestling, um, some great competition. Uh, I think it's going to be a you know we're in a big venue. Um, there's going to be. A different level of, of excitement and and I think for everybody involved a different level of competition so um, you're, you're going from everybody's only experienced a one-day conference tournament we're moving to a, a two-day tournament so there's a lot of different facets involved and uh, it, it'll probably come down um, you know I think Oklahoma State's obviously a pretty heavy heavy favorite but I think a lot of um, your, your team's individual success when you, when you end the weekend is going to be based on who deals with um, the newness of this, who deals with the two-day weigh-in best, who deals with the atmosphere best, who deals with the, con um, the, the level of competition best. So um, that's what it's going to come down to. I'm sure everybody feels good and, and likes how their training's going. It's, it's just going to be um, you know who steps out on the mat and performs better there. Oh, I expect all of us to come out and just battle. I mean, honestly, we have nothing to lose. You know, a lot of us have to make an upset happen to be able to go to nationals. So what do you have to lose, you know? You, you might as well go out there, throw everything you got at him and the kitchen sink and see what happens you know and just just believe like I said before and just go after him